Oh, shit. Oh, shit. There we go. All right, all right. What's up, guys? It's Childish here. Checking in. Hopping on. Attempting to use a real crappy application called Shoe Show. I don't even know how it works. Ghetto settings, ghetto recording. Doesn't even let me edit anything, but we'll, uh, we'll test it out for now. Give it a little taste. Why? Because I ain't got anything else to test it with. Ugh. So, I don't even know where to begin. I think we're going to just start with Arena here. I'm playing around with uh, some units, but maybe I should go real quick and just kind of show you the five units or six units that I basically rep when I'm in Arena. Everyone knows Megan. Got the uh, swift focus setup, speed, hit points, and accuracy. Broke, fatal blade, cup of rune suck, attack all the way around. Hopefully with the next rune removal, I'll switch into violent blade. Want to test them out, see how it goes. Stats are pretty general, nothing crazy. Ardella, aka the bad bitch. He's, she's the one-shotter. One hit wonder. Max skills. Fatal endure with a crit damage on the four slot. And then uh, attack on the other two. So, um, I think I've already talked to people online. This is what the video is for. Obviously, I'm not trying to publish this in any of the other websites or whatever. But, uh, the reason why it's fatal endure is just because that's uh, the runes that I got. Didn't really have rage runes from the get-go. Found my first uh, six-star endure attack rune, so I ended up putting them on him and having that with a nice substat. And then never found a good six-star rune here, but uh, knew that he benefited from uh, extra crit damage since his passive is uh, very, very high. So I was like, why don't I just keep the fatal set but use crit damage? So I did that, and it's worked pretty well for me. Um, on rare occasions, I'll use Soha, the Awakened Water Nine-Tailed Fox. Nothing crazy here. Fatal Focus, Attack, Attack Accuracy. Could triple up on the accuracy, but uh, I get into a lot of situations where I'm fighting against teams um, uh, versus a Wind Sophid or a... Uh, you know, another Megan, um, or somebody, you know, some kind of a tankish type unit with some, their own little immunity self buff. This helps out a lot if, uh, Megan's, uh, Toad Poison fails. Whoops. And then, we got good old Jameer. A lot of ways of going about him, just depends on what you want to do it for. I still consider him a support, I'm not using him for damage, um, um, I've seen people do violent energy with this guy. I've seen people do um, swift energy. I've seen people go all around energy. Um, me personally, since he has, um, you know, he's given attack speed on his substat, I went ahead and just did swift for now. It's kind of silly to do swift um, without emphasizing on the speed on two slot, but um, I really haven't gotten any um, um, really good... Um, speed runes that I can switch out in there so for now just gonna use that and uh, um, you know go from there hopefully I have a six star two slot um, energy rune I have a six star speed rune um, for energy slots so I'll probably put that there put a swift one here but I have no decent um, swift runes that are up so you'll notice that a lot of the reasons why some of these Units still have three stars or four stars is just because there's nothing really better. So, um, the Light Fairy, Violent Energy, I prefer going hit point, attack, attack if I can. So the damage is uh, relatively decent, and um, um, but you got a little bit of hit points, a little bit of survivability. Um, uh, this particular setup has been kind of weird for me. I basically have this setup for Giants. I need speed on this one to go first so he can cast his invincibility. Prior to my um, uh, 
imps um, attacking. So um, that's the way it's set up. So um, accuracy just to help with the stuns when they land. And uh, that's about it. So you got Megan, Roke, Ardella, Soha, Jameer, and Neil. Let's give it a go. Let's see. Mm. This will be interesting. So on this particular one, I am going to go without Jameer because they do not have any kind of speed leader. So therefore, I'm going to be utilizing more um, of an aggressive approach and seeing if I can um, take him down uh, relatively quickly. So we start out. Go and load it up. Gotta slow that one first, and hopefully this one shots. Oh no! Oh no! Hmm. That was a little off, but we'll still recover. So normally the goal is, um, you know, one shot the wind or water unit, depending on which one it feels going to be. Is going to be, uh, you know, more challenging. Um, uh, the water dragon being able to freeze, I consider him kind of like a tyrant, so I wanted to take him out first. Um, I'm not worried about the wind. Um, what's her name? The wind. Oh, now I'm forgetting. Period. Um, she does some good single target damage, but nothing to really crowd control this team. Hmm. Um, this might this might hurt a little bit. I don't even know what I would do with this one. How would I set this one up? Hmm. I might have to come back to that one. That one seems kind of interesting. Let's see. Joy Butterfuku over here. Yeah, buddy. This one should be good. And again, not worried about the um, um, the throwing Jameer in for the speed. I don't want to do too many supports. Um, Megan's buff is going to be enough. Um, I'm going to go ahead and obviously take out Lucian first. A little one-hit shot. And even though I'm going to be stronger against the wind... Um, I'm hoping that um, I either team up with Hua to um, reduce the attack gauge bar on Verdil or team up with uh, Ardella to one-shot Verdil. Oh, so I got Hua to do it, but it wasn't, uh, it wasn't enough to basically stop him from, you know, or allow me to get an extra turn or whatever. So... Either way, still got him down. This is pretty much an auto attack. I'm gonna worry about trying to micromanage this. If I can't do this, uh, I'll be in trouble. All right, going through trying to make the video as quick as I can here. Oh, ooh, kill him! Ooh. This one, I'm going to play it a little bit more safe. I'm going to bring in Neil. Um, it's a six-star um, Wind War Bear, uh, Ramico. So you all know that that's going to be, you know, unless you got a pretty, pretty strong team to um, take the hit. You know, hit, clean shot is pretty, pretty devastating. It really doesn't, um, it really doesn't, how do I say there's nothing that really can prevent it. It's just going to happen. So I'm going to go ahead and go ahead and uh, immune or invincibility up uh, Megan. Oh, Violent went off again. I'll go ahead and take out Neil. One hit wonder, 20k, no big deal. Um, looks like this guy focused on hit points or defense. His, he went down way too quickly. Way, way too quickly. So, could I actually just use my non regular attack? 
Looks like we got that defensive buff on there, but, or defensive buff, but we don't have um, our defense buff for Megan, so she's probably not going to die. And now we might be in trouble, but I'm hoping that the stun plus the, the double attack will get it done. Looks like it does. Again, we're down to one. Nothing exciting. If I can't take a five-star arena down auto, then I'm in trouble. But uh, we'll be okay. Kill him. Ooh. Get him. Alright. Next up. Oh, we got some winners. Oh, really? Well, whatever. Gotta move on up. I'm sitting at 2,500. I only got 3,000 more to get my number one before the end of tonight. So, definitely gonna make it. It's coming. You know. It's wasting these. Oh. And so if it, uh, uh, all right, all right, okay. So this one will, uh, well, obviously the this guy's not going to be as strong as uh, um, they were in the past. So let's go ahead and match up speed for speed, Megan for Megan. So we make sure we get the upper hand. And I think I'm going to go that route. They're all going to go for Megan. Megan's going to go for Roke. She's not going to kill Roke because utility units are not set up for DPS. So my goal is to basically <sighs> probably, I'll probably try to team up on the Imp, get him down, and then maybe um, um, try to one-shot um, the six-star unit. Orochi. I don't think I can make her any reason for not doing either either one. Either one would be fine. Notice that their Megan actually got the uh, extra attack here, so hopefully the team up with Ardella will kill this guy. Oh, didn't happen, but that's all right. Oof. So as much as I want to kill this one, I'm gonna see if I can actually one shot this my man. Got him. All right. So. There's uh, there's your proof, people. Um, Ardella, Fatal Endure, with crit damage, works. Well, Endure doesn't mean nothing, but Fatal set with a crit damage can work just as good um, with, uh, with that kind of focus. I'm not really concerned about this. Ooh, kill him. Look at this guy. A little dark. Ooh, nice. AoE sleep. So that'll be interesting. Um, this particular setup, we're going to go anti-win. We're going to bring Ardella, one-shot the Dark Sylph, and use Neil since she has high speed. Put the invincibility on Ardella so that basically we take Roke and Jojo out of the equation. Um, hopefully the, 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 what's it called, the, um, the bombs don't hit, but it uh, looks like we should be okay. Definitely don't want Rogue to get any kind of skills. There you go. Kill him, and we'll auto this. I'm trying to keep this video as quick as I can, because Lord knows I'm making, this is making a big old, ooh, you see that Rogue was, hey, he said, what? He said, turn down for what? That's why I need to get him set up for violent energy. Come to us. If you're watching this shit, would you please give me a rune removal so I can move about 1.3 million worth of runes on guys? Can't wait. I got two six-star runes for Roke um, going violent energy attack runes. So I'm definitely ready. Um, yeah, this is a stupid fight, but we need to... Uh, we need to get our buff up, so let's go ahead and do it. Doesn't really matter who I attack, but we'll pre prevent Ardella or protect Ardella just in case. Everybody should die. Yeah. God bless those people with the same match point as me, chilling with four star units. 
Y'all messing with the big boys. Uh, he's not even trying, obviously. He has no points. So, 36. 37. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, man. This guy doesn't have speed leader. That means I can do the heal thing. Oh. What do I want to do? This one's hard. I kind of want to bring... um. I kind of want to go with like crazy um, with uh, Hua here and just bring a lot of a lot of damage. See if I can kill him beforehand. Should we try it? Okay, so the smart thing to do would be to bring the healer, right? Right. But as you already know, I'm a childish player and I play to win and we ain't trying to play no safe game. Now, I think uh, the defense on the Valkyrie is going to be um, a little bit more, and I'd have a better possibility of one-shotting the water unit versus the wind unit. So, we're going to go for the water unit. Got him. All right. So, obviously, two healers and six star. Um, I'm not worried about I'm not worried about losing this now, but anything can happen, so still so play it safe. Oh, man. Can I still reduce the attack gauge? Nope, I don't think so. No, yeah, just gotta waste. Uh... Oh, low battery. Come on. Kind of really wanted the defense break there for Ardella coming up, but that's all right. It's gonna be. Oh my god, that Roke. I can't get enough of him, though. Everyone's like, I gotta substitute Roke out. He's just not good at end game. Are you kidding me? And I don't even have Violin on this guy. Killing him. Why am I... I don't even know why I'm sitting here autoing. I'm not autoing. Alright. Hopefully this video is not too long. Buff 8. Gotta take this guy out. I mean, you know what? We're having fun. Don't even matter. We're gambling. Let's. We're gonna see if my 160 speed on Megan is better than whatever speed this guy has with his speed buff. And if that's the case, we got him. Oh 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 no! Oh, there we go. Look at that. He done did it now. I'm going to slow this guy. One shot this guy. And the stun. That's lovely. But that's okay. Because these guys are the are the uh, are not as strong as they look. Four star Max Shannon, that's kind of a weak point there. That's especially when I'm heavy on fire there with Hua and Roke. Um, let's see, was that the one we wanted to go? Ooh, shit. Attack speed. Um thirty-three. So we're not even gonna be able to match. I don't even know what we would do on this one. He has a revive. So, go for the one shot on Julie, team up on Julian, and then maybe go back to whoever the Valkyrie heals, revives, and kind of go from there. I mean, it sounds kind of weird, but it might actually work. So, basically, this is one of those fights where I don't think I should win, but it all just depends on how beastie my... Oh shit. Yeah, that's that's not good. That is not good. So, as you can see, I didn't even get a an opportunity to cast my um thing. What is it called? The big buff. Oh my god, I didn't even kill her. That's 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 horrific. Depressing. Depressing. 
Alright. Well, since it's uh, obviously over, we're going to end that one. Actually, Jameer's going to win. Never mind. This is... Now I wish I just had one more arena invitation, but I don't. And I want to see if I have challenges. No. Arena, 15 minutes. Go figure. Ugh. Yeah, I'm going to get that guy again. So I'll probably send you guys a picture in the Lion AD for those that are in that chat channel. Um, anyways, uh, thank you guys uh, for watching. Thanks for your support. And I will hopefully continue to make videos um, with this stupid program. <laughs> uh, if not, find a better program. Uh, until then, man, take care.